Like a family that can no longer take the big trip to the lake in Wisconsin for a week, but instead is just taking the kids to Silver Dollar City for a Saturday, the nation has dropped plans to go back to the moon. I am delighted to be here. And I'm particularly delighted to be here on this occasion. How far we've fallen from September 12, 1962. That was just 17 years after we beat Hitler and saved the world. President Kennedy announced his big plans for the family trip to the moon, acknowledging that some were reluctant to take such a big jaunt. Some would have us stay where we are a little longer to rest, to wait. But this city of Houston, this state of Texas, this country of the United States was not built by those who waited and rested and wished to look behind them. President Kennedy gave the whole nation a goal that we could see every night hanging above our backyards and Little League fields. Why some say the moon? Why choose this as our goal? And they may well ask, why climb the highest mountain? Why 35 years ago fly the Atlantic? Why does Rice play Texas? We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. In about two months after his speech, Kennedy would be assassinated. But in seven years... I'm going to step off the limb now. It's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. They've got the flag up now, and you can see the stars and stripes on the lunar With a whole other story, I'm Kevin Killeen.